Hello Kylie's, it's Mary and welcome back to the Kylie Closet. So today's video, if you've seen the other one you're like, mm, you don't look different, I don't look different because <laughs> I've done multiple um, filmings in one day today. So if this is your first time visiting my channel then welcome. This is the Curly Closet where I discuss natural hair with a bit of lifestyle and a bit of beauty thrown in from time to time. And also, if you're returning, thank you for returning. So today's video is going to be another first impressions video and it's going to be the first impressions of this little bottle right here which is the Camille Rose Naturals Coconut Water Leave-In Detangling Hair Treatment. And I paired this with another Camille Rose Naturals product which is the Camille Rose Lavender Crush Defining Gel. Now for this bottle I only have a sample size and um, I was only able to get a sample of it but the sample was enough to use on my hair as a leave-in. I did not use it as a detangling hair treatment because I detangled with my deep conditioner. So the only um, review or first impressions review I'm giving of this product is how it works as a leave-in. This product right here I have never seen before. I love good smelling stuff and I'm kind of picking up on a theme with the Camille Rose Naturals is that everything that they do smells heavenly because their stuff smells so good and if it smells so good to me I mean I'm just saying this should come like with like a a bit of a warning if you don't want to get pregnant don't put on, don't use this stuff on your hair and your body so as usual I am going to let you see my demo and how I felt just putting the products on my hair initially and then I'll be back at the end of the video with a final first impressions review of the two products this is the Camille Rose Naturals coconut water leave-in detangling hair treatment so I'm going to be using that first so first impressions, this leave-in is pretty thick because I'm trying to get it out of the bottle and it's not coming down. I'm going to have to actually squeeze it to see if I can get it out of this bottle. Yeah, it's, it's pretty thick. And it has a similar smell to the deep treatment. Goes onto the hair quite nicely. Feels good. Ooh, actually it feels very nice. It has that feeling like you're coating your hair with something but not, it doesn't feel like a bad type of coating. Which is good. Alright, I took some out, I've got like this much now. But so far, like, just as a first impression, this already feels nice. I'm having a good feeling about this, I'm liking this already. Okay, so as I usually do for my wash and go styles, I'm going to start at the back and work my way forward. Now, ooh, that feels really nice. This leave-in is, ooh. <laughs> oh, that feels nice. Wow. Okay. So, as usual, I have my um, spray bottle here. Where necessary I'm going to be adding a little bit more of this into the individual sections and then I'm going to be adding the Lavender Crush Defining Gel. Now, what I do like about this is the it's got one of them flip top openings which is nice um, and it is sealed which is also nice. It looks quite runny though. Yeah. You know it's funny, I actually anticipated that it was going to be this level of lavender smell. I just hope that I don't have bugs and flies and things following me around because I'm going to smell like a flower when I'm done with this. Um, I'm going to put my finger like this in it so you can kind of see this is the consistency. Like I can't lean it because, yeah, I can't lean it. <laughs> a little bit more of this like that much and I'm debating with myself today whether I really want to try and do some real extra definition or this if this is just going to be a very happy raking 
products from my hair and getting on with my day kind of day I don't know I'll see how I feel but so far the feeling of this on my hair is beautiful crush defining gel my hair smells of lavender very runny has a nice amount of slip though whoa Okay. Okay. Wow. Okay. Okay. <gasps> wow. Look at that. No, but really. No, seriously. Camille Rose, you did that. I just wanted to show you this. So on this side, I only have the leave-in conditioner in, right? Look, look at this. Look how much definition I am getting just from the coconut water leave-in conditioner. My hair is so moisturised feeling. I'm trying right now not to like get over excited and over exaggerate okay because that can happen but I have never never achieved this kind of definition on my hair without actually trying to like do my little finger coil semi finger coil method. I'm literally just raking, I've put leave-in in the section and I'm just raking the gel through. That's all I'm doing. Look how much definition I'm getting. I'm going to shake my head a little. Because sometimes it just, not too hard man, but sometimes it just helps to, the curls to kind of go naturally where they're meant to go. But anyway, essentially, this is what we have. It's not dry, as you can see. I have this bit pinned back, which is what I was going for. Um, I'm not really gonna be able to see the final, final style until it dries. But essentially, this is the result so far. So I'm back and here are my thoughts. Number one, this little bottle right here packs a punch, okay? I use maybe half of this, just over half of this, for my whole head. It has amazing slip. It really gives a beautiful, nourishing feeling to your hair. Like, my hair was feeling, like, not quite itself. It felt a little bit drier than normal. But putting this on my hair, it's like my hair was like, yes, thank you, this is what I needed. It goes through your hair really easily. Once you put it in your hair, you can feel like your hair is coming back to life. That's how I felt. And it was a really, really good base for my styling products that I wanted to use afterwards. And to be completely honest, I'm a bit concerned because... I have the feeling like Camille Rose is going to just be taking so much of my money after this point. After this leave-in, yeah, definitely. Another thing I will add as well, which is something that you should have seen in the demo. If you like to just give your hair very, very light definition with a lot of moisture, you will only need to use this. You don't need to use a gel or anything else. The only reason you probably need to use a gel is if you really want to add more definition to your hair and maybe give your hair a bit more weight and a bit more hold. But if you just want like beautiful moisture that adds a bit of definition, you can literally just use this product. It will do the job. Or if you don't like to use too many products back to back and you just want to use one, this I would recommend. So I'm trying to find like a reason not to give this a 10 out of 10 for my first impression. But I can't. For my hair, for the way that my hair really needs moisture and nourishment, this is a 10. Now as for this Lavender Crush Defining Gel, Fam, I am not exaggerating. I have never experienced the level of definition from a gel. 
that I have done from this. It has a high glycerin content which means it has a lot of slip. It's beautiful, it's beautiful and this is essentially the end result that I got from using this gel right here. Now usually when I just rake product through my hair I do kind of get like a curly fro like this but I do not get as much like curl definition as I have with this style right here. I'm gonna come a bit closer so you can see like okay this is like my kind of like curly fro-esque type deal but you can see like in bits the level of definition that I have is actually quite crazy. Even when I use gel like um, another type of gel like eco styler gel let's say which is um maybe thick thicker and heavier um i don't know it doesn't do it doesn't do the same as this now as for hold um i would have to wear my hair for a lot longer to really give this like a proper review in terms of hold and basically use some of this on my hairline at the front and you can see like my hairline is not like really really laid down so it doesn't seem like it's that kind of gel that would really like is really going to give you that superior level of hold if that's what you're looking for in that regard if i wanted a gel if that has a lot more hold for like updos puffs that kind of stuff i don't think i would use this because it seems to give more of a soft hold than a really hard hold um but the positive side of that is that my hair actually feels like it's not completely dry so I can't judge how crunchy it may or may not get but as it stands my hair feels quite soft even the bits at the back that usually dry first feel quite soft if I were to give any cons I would say it's rather sticky so if you don't like like sticky gels this may not be the one for you but to be honest for like the actual results that it's given me I don't mind the level of stickiness that it has like I can work with it my final first impressions mark out of 10 I would give this gel I want to give it a 10 but I'm actually gonna give it a 9 and the reason why is because of the claims of the product it claims it says lavender infused hair gel crafted for definition and extra hold okay definition yes but extra hold I would say no I would say okay it's holding my hair but for me an extra hold product would be something that would literally lay my hair down like the front of my hair my hairline edges whatever you want to call it however if I were to judge it as just a gel to put through your hair and to like define your hair define your curls I would have to give it a 10 for that so let's average it out, let's call it a nine and a half, okay? <laughs> Overall though, between this coconut water leave-in hair treatment and this lavender hair gel by Camille Rose. Camille Rose is about to take my queens, they're about to take my queens. And they're gonna get me pregnant too, I'm just saying. And did I mention that both of these, especially this one, they smell divine they smell so good so so good so curlies I hope that you enjoyed this review I certainly enjoyed trying out these products my hair is very happy today I'm I'm just like yes I'm ready to go out and just be like yeah. I do hope that you enjoyed this review and if you did enjoy this review then please give it a very big thumbs up below you can also hit the red subscribe button if you have not subscribed to my channel already um, I love to do first impressions reviews and for some of my first impressions reviews I also do follow up reviews but for sure you will be seeing both of these products at some point in the future in my videos because I love both of them so much thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon again on the curly closet wishing you health, happiness and beautiful hair I'll see you again soon, take care